Welcome to Only Good Heroes. I'm your host, Lucia Nazaro, and on this show, we highlight incredible people and organizations making a huge impact in their community and our world. And today, we have two incredible guests with us, Lisa Lewis. She is the founder of Optum Circus. I love your background, Lisa. Um, for those that can't Thank see, <laughs> the bold new circus. There you go. And Matt Axel. Matt is the director of Disability Unite. Um, thank you both for joining me today. Thank you for having us. Matt, could you tell us a little bit about um, the organization you work for and then the program you are the director of as well? Project Access for All is a community consortium, meaning it is an umbrella organization comprised of a number of different organizations. It was created at the 25th anniversary of the ADA five years ago, and um, since then has been involved with the Disability Pride um, Parade in New York City and a number of other programs. But the goal behind it was, aside from celebrating the ADA, was bringing the disability community together. And that's really what Disability Unite is all about. It's right there in the name. Uh, the disability community has so many different sub-communities within it that there's so much rich culture within the disability community, but it's also the reason why it's hard to get all everyone around the same table. And the disability community has a lot of power. One in four people have a disability. 50% of America knows someone or is someone who identifies as a disability. And with numbers like that, you think we would see real action, but it takes people coming together to make that progress. And that, that's our goal. Omnium is a creation. It's like a phoenix flying out of the pandemic. Given everything that happened at the beginning of the pandemic, um, it's a project that's been in my heart for many, many years. And this was the opportunity, I like to call it an omnium opportunity. But this was the opportunity to bring to fruition a dream that many of us have shared, which is a completely accessible and inclusive circus on both sides of the ring. So for many years, I've created access for audience members. But that's not enough for me. You need to look in the ring and say, oh, wow, that one looks just like me. Or to look at your neighbor and say, wow, that person's amazing. They're, in a, wheel they're a wheelchair user just like you are. So to be able to have that across racial divides, ability to cross everything that society has in our place to divide us, but to bring it together to unite us in joy, because the circus is all about joy and celebration. Lisa and Matt, how did you, obviously two incredible organizations, how did you both connect? Oh, this one's fun. So I'm creating this circus. All of these amazing people are coming together. And I know, as you both know, I know how to create Access Live. I know how to make everybody feel welcome and include everyone and accommodate any bridge they need for access to be able to fully enjoy an experience. Mm -hmm. Well, when we move into the virtual world, that's not my strength. Mm -hmm. So I reached out to a friend of mine that I know works within the disability community. And I said, help, I need help here. She goes, you have to meet my friend Elizabeth. So I meet her friend Elizabeth, who happens to work with Matt. Am I allowed to say this, Matt? Oh, yeah. That's his mom. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and she's awesome. That's how she got the free labor. <laughs> <laughs> so we started talking, and the more we talked, the more we realized how closely aligned our missions really, really are. Question, what is the show going to be like? So tell us, Lisa. So the show is going to be incredible. What we did is all of the acts that we're planning to bring together live, which obviously isn't happening now, are instead recording their acts for us. So it's gonna be a live stream production. And because of the nature of our world, when you log in, tickets are available right now, very easy. You go to omniumcircus.org, page that says tickets and get a ticket. Mm -hmm. Or you can go to Circus Talk, which is an industry media leader, and you can, get on their website as well, go to Circus Talk events. 
So when you get to the platform, when you log in that day to see the show, there's four buttons across the bottom. And you choose if you don't want to press any buttons, don't press any buttons. If you need audio description, if you need ASL, if you need simple text, if you need captioning. And there's two really awesome things about that. Number one, most of the ASL will be integrated within the production because we have our ringmaster does all of the verbalization, all of the speaking, and he has a sidekick who is a wonderful performer who happens to be a coda, which means a child of deaf adults. So ASL is his first language. So he and our ringmaster, Jonathan Lee Iverson, will be collaborating on that. And we are also introducing a brand new, ever introduced in this country, straight from Israel, simple text format, and we get to be the first to premiere it. So I'm super excited about that. And we have just started and it's live and action, actionable at the moment, our Raise the Tent fundraising campaign. So we are trying to raise our enough money. We're a not-for-profit organization and we are trying to raise enough money to be live next summer. We'll be working in collaboration with Disability Unite for the Disability Festival and we're planning a three city tour, maybe more. We have a gorgeous tent. Um, it's a, at the moment, it's a 2000 seat tent, but we'll see what COVID says and how many people we actually see. Matt, how and why did you get involved? We, we know why logistically, but how is your organization helping um, the circus? The reason we got involved is because Disability Unite is a streaming platform, first of its kind ever, that was created with accessibility in mind right from the very beginning. It's built into the foundation. And what makes it so unique is that for every event we put on, you have the choice of uh, your accommodation. So the stream that has sign language and captioning is separate from the stream that has audio description or the simple text or simplified language as it's called. The disability community deserves a platform for them. And uh, when I heard what Lisa was doing, she's creating a circus built around accessibility as well. It's for all people. It's truly for all people. I'd love to know, what do you hope people take away from this circus and this experience? Lisa, you first and then Matt. I hope people take away from it a realization that at our core, we have so much more in common there's so much more that unites us than divides us. Abilities and disability and race and culture and socioeconomic status and all of these things which divide us don't matter because at our core, we love, we laugh, we care about our kids. Mm -hmm. We want to share. And I feel like one little step towards positivity, I can't change the whole world. Yeah. But to create that one little smile and that one little seed that's what I hope for people to gain. Beautiful. Matt? This is why I love Lisa. Yeah. <laughs> um, I would say, and this is of course my opinion, but I hope people understand and walk away from this knowing that accessibility is a choice. It's something that each of us can do if we care to put in the effort. A uh, circus like Lisa's is built around accessibility. It's accessible for all people. The, our website, Disability Unite, is accessible for all people. And each of the people joining, they have the choice of making things accessible. Very well said, Matt. And um, I think you both are absolutely doing your part um, to make that happen. So thank you both so much. And on behalf of Only Good Heroes, we'd like to make a $100 donation to your organization, Lisa, and to your organization, Matt, um, to help you thank continue you so much. your work. Um, so thank you for being a guest on the show and the work that you're doing to make life inclusive and entertainment and fun inclusive as well. And join us for the show. Yeah, absolutely. December 12th, five o'clock, join us. We'll make sure all the links are included so you can join the show as well. Um, Lisa Lewis, Matt Axel, thank you so much for joining us. And for more inspiring stories, make sure to head over to onlygood.tv and you can find us on Instagram at onlygood.tv. We'll be back with more Only Good Heroes.